right, we're checking out the only game where you're an endangered species that's literally a danger to every other species. It's Tasty Planet Forever Penguins. Here we are, tiny little penguin. Sad, depressed. Well, actually, maybe we're not because somehow we can fly. Now, as you can see right here, penguins don't have any problems eating things such as other living creatures and apparently sunflower seeds. So the idea is, is that pollution and technology have basically ruined your entire life and have thrown you out of, you know, your your Arctic Circle or whatever at this point. And the only thing that's left to do is to get revenge. Now, what am I eating now? Is it like a tiny meatball? Oh, it's a, it's a little meat chunk. I love how it doesn't specify what kind of meat it is. Oh. That, uh, that fly just ran right into my mouth. So technically I didn't murder him. He kind of murdered himself. I like how this fly over here is just like, I'm gonna mind my own business and maybe he won't see me. Oh, I see you. Grain of rice that's very healthy, little meat chunk. Oh, some teriyaki sauce. Mm, love teriyaki sauce. What can I eat up here? Oh my God. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I didn't see that coming. I'm not gonna lie as a Floridian, if I could just, have a, a pet penguin that would eat all of the mosquitoes. That would be fantastic. To be fair, I think that eating all of these like living creatures is pretty realistic because don't penguins eat fish or whatever? I'm not sure if the penguin actually cares how, how much life is left in the fish at the time. I don't know. I really don't know any penguins personally. I met a penguin once and I, I gave him a hug. It was at SeaWorld though. But see, if the penguin was like this penguin, it was constantly growing to the point where it would become as big as a planet, I'd probably not have hugged him. Because I'd be afraid that he would murder me. We're eating black flies now. So we're at one centimeter in size. Oh, is that a bigger meat chunk? It looks like a bigger meat chunk. Whoa! Oh, I'm not gonna lie, like, butterflies from this close up look very, very evil. Alright, so what is this, like an M&M? &M? Yep. Oh, it's a tapioca pearl! Where am I? Like, what is in here that I'm eating? What was What's that? Oh, I thought I could eat these gigantic chunks over here. Was it like French fries or something? Give me your meat! Now, if I, if I don't get to be like, you know, ow! If I don't get to at least eat several buildings, you know what, actually I want to eat like a mountainside. That'd be fantastic. I like it when the things I'm eating are, ooh, it's a big meat chunk. I've upgraded. I like, what was that? Oh, it is a French fry! Also, did you hear the sound that the penguin made? That is like really concerning. <laughs> that may be an actual penguin sound, but I'm, oh, I'm gonna need you to calm down, Mr. Penguin. What I was trying to say is I love eating things that really should not be edible at all. Oh, it's a butterfly. Oh, animal. I just, I just, I eat, I eat the beautiful things, the less beautiful things at this point. I thought I was gonna get my revenge on humanity, but I don't know, maybe just because moths and butterflies get along with human beings so well. I, I guess I'll take out my hatred on them too. Ooh, like entire teriyaki sticks. That's what I'm talking about. As I go in there, butterfly, the butterfly's like, well, I'm minding my own business. Could you not? <gasps> too bad. Look, man, it's for the purposes of the game. I need to get to unreasonable sizes. And right now I'm at a totally reasonable size. I don't like it. I love that there's little, I don't know, like fruit bats or whatever too. I'm not gonna lie, Mr. Bat, you look. Delicious. Am I gonna eat this stuff? Ooh. Oh, meat on a stick. Oh yeah. Oh, I love meat on sticks. Oh, your extra fries. Also, like, does no one take care of this area? Like, no one's picked up the trash in who knows how long. I should be getting paid for this. As I eat every living being around me, something else I thought about, if I can eventually just eat the atmosphere of the whole universe, then I will be flighted as a bird because there won't be anything to hold me back. I've decided I know what this penguin sounds like. It sounds like if you took a normal bird and then you possessed it, like, with the exorcist, that's what this voice sounds like. Here, you don't believe me? Hold on, let me, let me... Oh, let me find something here, right? Right there, hear that? Exorcist, right there. I am literally eating styrofoam containers. I'm gonna have a great, <laughs> oh, oh, it, it's, it's time for vengeance. I was gonna say, I'm gonna have a fantastic time trying to pass those styrofoam containers out the, out the digestive system later on. Where's your styrofoam at? I'm here to clean up this city, like literally clean up this city. Did I just eat a brick? Bubble tea cup. I'm pretty sure I ate a brick though. I did. I ate an entire brick. Am I gonna eat the cinder blocks eventually? Oh, it's, it's owls. Oh, I love owls. Kind of makes me feel bad that I'm eventually going to be devouring them mercilessly. Seriously, you guys do not take care of your city at all. 
I'm starting to not feel bad that I'm going to destroy all of humanity. Well, all humanity and every other living creature on this entire planet, apparently. Someone's gonna have their parakeet chilling out outside, then they're gonna come home from work, and the only thing that's gonna be left is, I don't know, whatever the feathers are that a penguin has. Ow. I think I just gave that owl brain damage. I don't know what a penguin would leave to let them know that a penguin was there, like penguin droppings or something. Oh! I could just eat the cinder blocks now! Why not? Mm. Packed full- <laughs> Packs full of vitamins! Oh no, I eat the owls! I really like owls too. For breakfast, I mean. What in the... What am I dealing with here? What am I gonna have to take out like bionic soldiers? What is that, a hoverboard? It's like a hover motorcycle. Give me your cinder blocks. I need them to grow. Don't ask me why, I don't know either. Listen, this is how ecology works, all right? Ow! You're gonna pay for that! Guy's probably just heading home from work. Not for long. Don't mind me just doing some building maintenance around your apartment complex. And by maintenance, I mean all of these various other creatures that live here. They're not going to live here anymore. Am I gonna get to eat all of the air conditioning systems? I won't actually have to murder the people if we're in Florida because you can't survive without an air conditioning system. Well, it's possible that you could survive, but you don't really want to. Oh, I'm eating cardboard boxes now. Look at how much cleaner this neighborhood looks because I ate everything. Look at it. Looks so much better. All of you are responsible for all this trash and I'm the one taking care of it. Look at that, bam, right there, boom. Oh, oh, you can't eat air conditioning systems. Yay! <laughs> oh man, the mean, uh, the, like the average temperature is gonna go up by about 20 degrees inside of this place. Also, I will say, it doesn't really look like anyone up. <gasps> oh, you get into people! Oh, oh, it's a cyborg. Those are cyborgs and humans living in harmony. Well, they were living in harmony. Now they're not living at all. No, no, come back. Come back. Look, I'm going to turn around. You won't know I'm here. Look, I'm not looking at you. I have no idea what's going on. Just kidding. <laughs> oh, is it the, ah, it's the police. You can't, you can't do this to me. I'm an endangered species. All right, apparently the police do not care. Sorry, everyone. Because of the police, I need to eat all of you so I have the strength to get back at them. Oh, you can eat the motorcyclists now. Come here, you look delicious. <laughs> ah, I'm eating the dumpster. <laughs> oh my God. It is a hover bike. I love how no one can be bothered to even run the police cars through a car wash. Ow. Oh my God, I just ate an entire car. I can't even tell you how much like Freon or whatever is inside of my body right now. Oh boy. I'll tell you, if there's one thing I love eating, it's tetanus. Mm. When I violently poop out all of these air conditioning units, can you imagine how many people that would murder on the ground? Just from the weight, I mean, a lot more than a than a compressor fix to fix everything I've done to these air conditioning units. All right, I think I've eaten absolutely everything on the ground floor. I'm now eating police, humans, hover cars. I don't know what that is over there, but I can't wait to dine on it. Anything cool up here? Oh, it's an entire sign. Now that oh oh my God, it's a hover car garbage truck. You guys weren't doing any work anyway. There's garbage everywhere. What garbage were you picking up? You weren't do you weren't doing it. The waste of taxpayer dollars. You're better off feeding the eight and a half meter long penguin. I am almost ten meters. Oh oh yes, hover bus. What is this shooting at me? Is this like the military after me now? <laughs> you guys better watch out. You're gonna end up murdering your own populace, you know. Hey, epic dodge. Oh, they killed one another. A hover tank just like blew up another hover tank. I assume that's what that is. I'm gonna keep eating these buses until I'm big enough to, to have my vengeance, to finally get back at those who destroyed my family, my ecosystem, my, the food sources. Yeah, you know who can't live off of microwave meals? Me. 
you did this. Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, the hover tanks. Oh, yeah. 22 meters. What's left? What what else can I eat? Am I going to eat, like, uh, space shuttles or something eventually? All right, so we can eat all of the tanks with absolutely... Oh, my God. I ate an entire apartment building. I am 30 meters. 31 meters. 30... Okay, we are getting... Oh, oh my... We are gaining meters real fast. I love how how out of control the penguin gets. We're at 46 meters already. Eat this! We're eating entire buildings. Oh boy. 59 meters. Hey, oh, 64 meters. <laughs> eating hover tanks, it's basically like a palate cleanser. That's all it really is. See, that's like a snack. It's like having a pistachio nut or something. I like to I like to eat full-sized skyscrapers when I can. This right here. You see it? This is what's causing all the pollution. I'll be back. I got to eat more of your friends first. Oh, here we go. Oh, there we go. Yep, factories. Look at that. Look at look at how much I'm helping out the atmosphere. Is this what are, what are people living on? Is this like a floating island? Oh, okay. 347 meters of penguin. Oh, there's more city up here. Yay. Imagine you live in like the high priced island and you're watching all these other islands get devoured by this derp of a penguin. And you're like, obviously that can't possibly happen to us. Oh, really? 510 meters of angry bird. What do I eat now? Hold on, I just gotta grab a drink by eating your oceans. Oh, I just eat the entire, oh, it's a floating island. I'm just eating the entire island now. I love it. 682 meters, 771, 817. We're almost 900 meters. There it is. 900 a kilometer this bird is now a kilometer oh my god oh 1.4 kilometers 1.64 are we gonna be a mile <laughs> oh no 3.69 kilometers <laughs> Well, I extincted everyone else before they could extinct me. There you go. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of Tasty Planet Forever. Till next time, stay foxy, much love. 